Hello boys and girls, my name is Miss Lund and I will be your kindergarten teacher for this school year. Welcome to Miss Lund's Lemonade Stand, where our motto is, when life hands you lemons, make lemonade. You might be thinking, Miss Lund, what does that even mean? Excellent question. Life can seem a little weird right now with those crazy things we have to wear on our faces everywhere we go, but that doesn't mean we can't make the most of it. Let's make some lemonade. I am so excited to meet all of you. I can hardly contain my excitement. I wanted to show you guys what a typical day would look like inside the classroom, so let's take a sneak peek. Wait, before we get started, I, I feel like I'm missing something, but... Know what I'm missing. My mask, duh. Here's me with my mask off, and here's me with my mask on. Mask on, mask off. I also have another mask that shows my whole face, so you'll be able to tell when I'm concerned, or even sad but this will be my face every morning when I get to see your beautiful faces. And guess what? You guys get to wear a mask too. But Miss Lund, why do we have to wear these? Excellent question. These masks are super important. They not only help keep you safe inside the classroom, but they also help your friends stay safe as well. And if we wanna keep coming to the classroom every day and having fun, we have to wear our masks. Enough of that crazy mask talk. Let's take a look at a day inside our classroom. The start of your day might look a little weird to you. Okay, mine was just a hairbrush. But every morning, someone will be placing something that kind of looks like this on your forehead, called a thermometer, just like this. That thermometer will check your temperature and that way we'll know if you're healthy enough to enter the classroom. After that, it's time to see me and your friends inside our classroom. But before we get started, I should probably tell you about another friend you'll be making this year. Each one of you will be getting your very own red folder. Now your red folder will have your name on it as well as your number. It is super, super important that you try and remember that number as hard as you can. This red folder will be your best friend. It will go to and from school with you. I will be putting important pages in there for mom and dad to see, and mom and dad can even put important notes in there for me to see. First thing you'll do when you come into the classroom is drop your red folder right in the cubby that has your number on it, just like this. Don't forget to grab your name tag on the counter by the sink when you're done. This name tag will go right on the front of your desk when you're done, just like this. Speaking of that, let's find our seats. Guess what? Each and every one of you will be getting your very own desk. Now you might notice some dots right below your desk. It's very important that those two dots stay in place and that the back two legs of your desk, the legs closest to your chair, stay on those dots throughout the day. That way we can make sure that everyone is staying six feet apart from each other. Speaking of that, you might notice that the desks are a little far apart. What's up with that? It's important that we maintain our social distance throughout the day. That way, we can all keep coming to school every day and having fun. So that's why you'll see your desk a little bit further apart from each other. Once you get to your desk, there will be another folder waiting for you. And I know what you might be thinking, Miss Lund, another folder? But these folders will help us stay organized. This folder will contain your morning work that should be completed in the morning. But don't worry, it'll be fun things. I hope you guys like to color as much as I do. You also might notice a basket by your seat that has your number on it. This basket will contain all of your materials for the day, like your iPad and your crayons and your pencils. But don't worry, no one else will be using those materials. They only belong to you. Hang 
going on, Miss Lund? Did you just say iPad? Yes, iPad. Each one of you will get to use an iPad throughout the day. We'll use these a lot during center time and we'll be able to use different apps on them. But the one app that we will use a lot is called Seesaw. Seesaw is an awesome app where we can post work for mom and dad to see and I can also see it too. And if we're ever missing mom and dad, we can always send them a quick picture throughout the day. Enough about materials. Once all of your friends have entered the classroom, the fun will really begin. If you thought having your own desk was cool, wait until you see your cubbies. Each one of you will be getting your very own cubby with your name on it. Now, in order to ensure that we maintain our social distance, only two of us will be able to go put our coat and backpacks away at a time. Once all of our belongings are put away for the day, we will begin our morning or afternoon meeting. During this morning or afternoon meeting, we'll take a look at calendar, the days of the week. We'll take a look at the weather for that day. Is it sunny or cloudy or rainy? And we'll even get to greet one another. Uh, hang on, Miss Lund. How will we greet our friends if we can't touch them or get too close to them? Excellent question. Here are some fun ways we can greet one another while staying at our seats and maintaining our social distance. Air high five, air fist bump, air kick, or just a wave hello. It will be awesome. Throughout the day, we'll learn about all kinds of fun things, like our letters and our numbers. But don't worry, we'll also have time to do some songs and dances, six feet apart, of course. We'll even get to go outside on our very own playground. Maintaining social distance, of course. I almost forgot. Every Monday, it is super important that you wear sneakers because we will be having PE class. Mrs. Goodling, the PE teacher, will take you through all kinds of fun activities. Now I know what you're thinking. It's going to be very hard to wear these masks all day and not be able to go up and hug our friends when we see them every morning. But don't worry, I will be there to remind you and help you along every step of the way. Now I only talked to you about a few fun things that we'll be doing this school year. I can't wait to tell you more about it and meet you in person. So what are we waiting for? Let's make lemonade out of lemons and get to it. I'll see you soon my little lemons.